I think about a, a Giants game, San Francisco Giants game that my family and I, we went to with another family and we decided that we were gonna use BART, Bay Area Rapid Transit, to get to the game and then you know, get away from the game and get back to our parked cars. Well, you know, sometimes I'm directionally challenged and that came into play on this, but I wasn't by myself. There was another guy, which I'm still not sure why it is that wives or girlfriends allow their husbands and boyfriends to choose the route. Uh, since obviously we don't know what we're talking about, I think you ought to jump in and just save us earlier than you do. But anyway, regardless of that, we were at the Giants game. It all went great. We lost. And we got on BART. As we were heading home, we realized, wait a minute, we're on the wrong train. And then we started calculating based on all the routes that they have inside the train where we're going. It's the exact opposite direction of where we were supposed to go. And you know what? We were going to be on that train for about another 30 minutes at least before we were going to get, be able to get back on track. Well, I think about that journey that we took as two families and then all the other people that were on the train with us. We had a choice as to how we were going to take that little diversion, that sidetrack, that misstep. We were on this journey. It's not what we wanted. But you know what? We had a choice. Are we going to travel angry, bitter, unforgiving, outraged, jealous of other people who got on the right train, envious of other people that got on the right train? Are we going to be mouthy? Are we going to be obnoxious? Are the other people on the train going to have to deal with us for the whole time until we get back on track? And then are we going to grumble the whole time getting back home? Or are we just going to travel as two families who took the long route home? You see, we knew we were going to make it home. There was not even a question that we were going to make it home. But how we traveled home, well, that is a choice that we had. It's a choice all of us have right now as we are on this journey of COVID. But hey, here's the reality, and you know this is true. We were all on a journey before COVID ever hit. Before any of these political seasons hit, we were all on a journey then too. And we had a choice in that. We always have a choice as to how we travel. And that's really a traveling choice of trusting him or not trusting God. And whether we do or don't trust God greatly affects how we travel.